All right, guys. I uh, just wanted to do an unboxing video of this Pittsburgh Spring Action Strut Spring Compressor. Just got this today at Harbor Freight, and I want to do an unboxing to show you guys uh, what's inside of the box and uh, how it looks like. So let's open it up. It was like sixty dollars at Harbor Freight. Here we go. piece hardware bolts I believe this piece goes inside the stud to keep it to allow you to only go with that certain certain um, compression so that would go into the end and then you have some nuts and a washer. Just your handy um, like manual, I guess. Here, so here's, um, I think this is a piece that prevents it from expanding, I guess. Locks it into place, I believe. I could be wrong, but. That's one of the other pieces that comes with it. Took this piece out. So this is the main, uh, what do you call it? The main frame, I guess, of the compressor, spring compressor. So I believe you would Get the stud and place it into the threading in here. But first, you would place this piece inside there. Actually, you put this one first into the threading, feed it into the threading, and you put this piece into there. And then, uh, I mean, I'll show you how to do it i just wanted to show you this is the unboxing of it that's how it looks like so you've pretty much seen everything that came from the box when we, we unboxed it and this is the cover the box cover again of the packaging again it's from harbor freight and it goes for around 60 bucks this one's kind of has a it's kind of reinforced has a little protection like a little cage around it so when you actually change the strut and the, the spring it's protecting you because your safety is first i recommend you seek professional assistance i'm just showing you and if you're going to do it do it at your own risk for the spring slide you're going to enter you're going to put the stud in here from the top and you're going to place that piece inside the middle Now it's locked in, click away like I showed you. Just use like a power drill with the socket here. It's a 24. Screw it in. Now you're gonna have it already installed. All right, and this, uh, like I showed you earlier, this is the safety bar. I believe this uh, it would go right here. Screw it in all the way. There's a safety bar right there, it keeps it from expanding.